Hey guys, so it's vlog 51 and we are one vlog away from a full year of vlogs and I'm super excited about that one. So I decided to do a what's in my bag and I'm speaking about my camera bag. This bag is from a company called Wandered and I absolutely love it. I actually just got it about a month ago, but I was planning on doing a bunch of traveling. So I decided to get a bag that could hold all of my camera gear. So right now I'm filming this off my Note 8 and until we get inside to my actual camera, you're gonna just have to deal with this quality for now. But without further ado, let's get into my bag. The bag is actually super nice. It has everything that I would ever need in a camera bag and more. I love all the features about it and I'll get into that as the video goes on. But first things first, I'm going to jump into the main compartment so I can get my camera out. So this little side guy right here is actually how I can get to my camera nice and quick. I pull it open and then my camera is right here and I can pull it out and voila. This is the GH5 with a Olympus 7 to 14 millimeter lens on here. So for now, I'm just gonna use this camera and then we'll switch, ready? All right guys, so the rest of this video is going to be film handheld with the GH5. So the compartment that I took my camera out is actually this little compartment here on the side, and that is where I house all of the important gear. Right on the little flap here, there's another little zip compartment that I store a lot of my extra batteries in. These are the GH5 batteries, as well as some GoPro batteries and the Canon G7X batteries, but we'll get into that in a little bit. So first things first, let's open up this main compartment right here so you can see what is housed inside this camera bag. So at first glance, you can kind of see that there are two main compartments right here. One is up here on top and the other one is right here. This is the most important compartment. So if I open this up right here, you can see all of my current camera gear. So what I have right here is basically another lens right here, which is the Olympus 12 to 100 millimeter. And then moving on, we have the Canon G7X, which I like to use sometimes for little candidates here and there. And when I want to go small and portable, I take this guy with me everywhere. And then right next to that, we have a GoPro Hero 5. This is what I use for underwater shots most of the time. And then right next to that, we have a Mavic Pro battery because you guessed it, right beneath it, there is a Mavic Pro. Pull this guy out here, it fits in nice and perfect. Take this pretty much everywhere with me because I'm trying to step up my drone game. So that is the basics of this first compartment right here. Let me close this back up. And then the compartment right above it basically has all of the accessories that go along with it. As you can see, I have the Mavic controller right here. I have an SD card holder that this basically houses all of my SD cards and more. And then we have a GoPro Hero 5 mount. As well, moving on, we have another little tripod mount that's pretty handy actually, that I use for the Canon G7X. Also in this top compartment, I hold all my chargers. So this is my MacBook Pro charger, which I'll get to later. And then moving on, we have the Mavic Pro charger, as well as the Panasonic charger. And we have one more in here, which is the Canon G7X charger. The GoPro charger is manual. And now right here, this is simply an external hard drive for me. So this is where I keep my external hard drive. It's basically four terabytes of strictly vlog footage and anything that I shoot that I would like to keep. And right to the left here, we have an adapter for my MacBook Pro so I can have HDMI, SD cards, etc. Toss that to the side. And then right here in this top little compartment, there's a little zipper right here. And inside this zipper, I basically have a little flashlight. This Because you never know when you're gonna need one of these. And the cool thing about this top compartment is that it is able to hold a Sorry, lot more. Sorry, I don't know that. Echo, I'm not talking to you. <laughs> so the cool thing about this top compartment. Oops, I thought I heard my name. <laughs> oh my gosh, I'm gonna kill her. So the cool thing about this top thing is it can un velcro do this, and it can basically open up to a larger, more spacious room to hold like clothes and stuff like that. So moving on, let's go down here where this little portion is. As you can see, it most likely holds the computer. So in here, the first compartment, I have a little seven inch tablet that I like to use whether you're on a plane, walking around, or something that you want that should be different than your cell phone and not as big as your computer. Most I'll use that for business emails. And then right down here, we have my main um, portable laptop, which is a MacBook Pro 15 inch touch bar, you know, 
etc. I use this a lot while I'm editing on the go. It's super nice, super portable, and very, very fast. So that's pretty awesome. So now if we close this little pack right here, you'll see there's a little hidden pack right here. This goes on my back at all time. This is where I keep the important stuff like a passport, or in this case, my wallet. So moving on to the other side of the camera bag, you can see that we have a tripod right here. This is actually a really nice tripod. It's very small and compact. It's a travel tripod from Manfrotto. The arms basically fold out and it makes it very quick and easy to set up. So in a nutshell, that is all the camera gear that I like to carry along with me while I'm filming stuff. Now, if I'm filming a wedding, a lot of this stuff will be very, very different as I have a whole shelf full of camera gear. So, so that was a lot of gear that I just went over. I typically don't take everything with me when I'm filming or shooting for a vlog. However, I like to take the GH5, this 714 lens, and this Olympus 12 to 100 lens, as well as my Rode Video Mic Pro on top. So, and my Mavic. I don't like to bring a ton of gear, so the less gear I can bring, the better, but this was more of a travel setup. So if ever I'm traveling the world, I will be taking all of this stuff with me so that I am a portable one-man crew. So hopefully you guys enjoyed this video today. If you did, smash that like button and subscribe because I'm gonna be making some more stuff in the future. I'll see you next time.